I'm just going to put out the back to be totally honest with you. Let's configure that. Wrong one. Uh, this is the back. So that's the right color and we'll just put a bit of piping. And nope, we don't want it to line up like that. We want it. So we'll break that there and we will put a chest here. Okay, so let's just configure those quickly in exactly the same way we have been doing everything else. So we hit it with a wrench, we put a pneumatic servo in which allows us to program it, and then we program it. And it take everything out, don't worry about the signal, and then in a few seconds, there we go, we get dust in this chest. Are you all? Uh, oh no, okay, well... You take care of yourself, other world princess, okay? Um, I hope you didn't get your head headache from headbutting an oven like a certain somebody. Uh, okay, so right, now, that's all our stuff. Okay, um, so we have gravel in here, sand in here, and dust in here. Okay, and... As you can see, this one's actually filling up quite fast. And once that's filled up, this one will start filling up again. And once those two are filled up, this one will start filling up again. So it actually takes a while. And what we want to do now is get this stuff into a sifter. And we're going to do that quite simply. And by creating a row of sifters for stuff to get into. And we shall do it... Uh, so I want a bit of space here, so I'm thinking let's do it here. And to do that, we are going to need a few more tools. So what we will do is we will grab these autonomous activators. We'll grab these clear glass covers. I knew I made some, I just couldn't see them for some strange reason. And we will grab these sieves. I don't think I want all those, so we'll just have eight. Okay, so these eight will. I'm just going to pop these down here like this. Looking up. Okay, right. You're playing silly buggers with me, aren't you? How about if we just look like that? No, nope, that's wrong. It's got to be looking up. I have any slabs. Let's grab this slab here. Nope, sorry, you couldn't have that. It's mine. My slab. So we'll put a slab there because then it'll be easier to jump. And we shall jump. There we go. That's all I wanted. And now it should be fairly easy to do three, four, five, six. And I've just realized that I need to put these across one, so let's go and dig them out. Takes a little bit of time, unfortunately. Don't eat them, luggage. A Damien fan. A Damien fan. Are you mad? Are you insane? Good lord, woman, have you met me? Right, nice. Uh, okay, so, yeah, we need to put them over here. The reason will be fairly obvious in a minute. So let's just put row three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Okay, and we want to put some piping out from these these chests. So let's grab. Oh, it's already on my inventory. Okay, so we'll just take. Well, so we'll just go over the top, really, haven't we? That's relatively neat. So this piping is going to loop around here and down here. 
And as you can see, there's a couple of connections we don't want. But if we hit them twice with a wrench, doink, doink, they disappear. No, I'm not getting that one quite right. Uh, I don't want to get down here because it's going to be a pain in the tail to get up. There we go. Right, doink, done. Okay, so now we just configure these quickly. Add a servo there, add a servo there. Add a servo there. And we're going to make these an outy rather than an innie. And just tell it to pump out your stuff. Alright, so like that. Do the same here. And do the same here. Hit the wrong place just slightly. There we go, that's it. And... You're going to make me go down here, aren't you? Yeah. Okay. Right, and that stuff should now all be going into these. It's not because we need to configure them all. And we should configure them all. I think it's that one. It is! Alright, and we need to turn them all off. Like that, okay. Because otherwise they'll just stick stuff out. We don't want that. So as you can see, this is filling up with... Well, this is basically filled up with everything we made. There's the sand and the dust will be... Yeah, the dust has come out. It's probably going into the next one. Or uh, Sand and there's dust. Okay, so everything we've made is now coming into these things. And I need my step back. Uh, actually, thinking about it, I could do with a few of these. So let's do that. There we go. Jump and jump. All right, so let's configure these up the same way. I want to turn them off for a second because there's stuff I want to do on top of them. Ooh, so, so we set that to high, which means it needs a, a, a redstone signal to do anything. And as you can see, the mouths stop working. Going like this. All right, so all these set up. And I just noticed I've missed a little bit of uh, piping here, so let's do that quickly. Don't worry, Miss Fujimoto. I'm sure there's no suspicious reasons whatsoever. It's for a fun day trip, isn't that right? That's why you want to take her to a lab. Yes. Please, come in. Sit down. Have a good time. Just ignore the dissection tools. They're just... I don't know why they're there, to be totally honest with you. I think they were just left over from... Uh... Oh, I don't know. We had a picnic here. Okay, so, now... What I want to do is I want to put sifting tables on top of these things. Like this. Okay, there we go. And then I want to use this glass to create a, a barrier around the whole thing. So we put glass. No, nope, wrong one. I thought that looked too dark. So we'll put glass around here like this. Uh, this, this is going to take a little bit of time, so I'd say talk amongst yourselves, but you already are. No, don't go there. Oh, there. Thank you. These are clear glass panels, by the way, which I really like the look of. And we do the same over here. Like this. How's the stream, by the way, guys? Any lag? I hope I'm not boring you to tears. Uh, 
that like that. A lag there. <laughs> oh, it's an acquired skill. These people are masters at it. They're, it's absolutely incredible. Um, right, so we'll put one more there just to seal things off. We'll see why in a second. And we're going to want a final chest down the bottom here. So we'll put the chest there and now I want a hopper froggy little gordon he did ride a huh froggy little gordon he did ride a huh all right um why do I sing that because it's a hopper so hopper into the chest there like that there we go a, ho a hopper to the chest ah it's even worse than an hour to knee I'm going to want another bucket of water. I'm feeling so very, very, very hobbled by the lack of a... Uh, I'm feeling really, really hobbled by the lack of... Um, of uh, a jetpack. I've got to be honest with you. There we go. And one last one. Just make ourselves a little ladder up here. And we'll put the water in there. We'll put the water in... And I've just realised what I did wrong. Okay. Um, these are not quite the right place. Because it won't fit a block of water in there. So what we shall do is let's go and get the glass again. And we should put them this time on the outside. Like that. So if we just put one there, that'll make it easier to do. Like that. If I put one there and put one outside it like that, again, it's going to make it easier to do. Give myself another little step there. I think I've trapped myself in here. We have to get rid of our safety fence. In fact, I might as well just do a simpler one over here. So let's go down here. Right, okay, so I'm going to need to get inside here and move all the glass ones, I'm afraid. That's going to take a second, but it's not going to take too long, I think. There we go, I'm in. Let's just get rid of these again. Let's get these out again. Like this. Sorry about going quiet on you, but this takes a touch of concentration. Put them in the right place. Micro blocking for fun and profit. So we're just, just creating a natural barrier down here. Like that. And now... We get a water flow. And that's going to take all the stuff down and put it in that hopper. 
And at this point, we should just be able to turn these hoppers on. And away we go. So... This one first. You see stuff starts going up into the sifter there. This one's got a little bit in it now, so we'll turn that one on. That one will start working. And so on. Let's just turn all these on. Okay, so this, the sifters, if you remember from the very start of this, the sifters take the material put in them, the gravel, the sand, or whatever, and they turn it into useful materials. And it's worth pointing out that most of this stuff at this point is going to be gravel, but eventually it's going to start filling up with sand as well. So if we look up here, you see there's a piece of gravel in there being sifted. And stuff is going to come out of there, and it's going to float down into the hopper, and it's here, and immediately, okay. We get, we got a diamond, we got some coal, we got some platinum, uh, aluminium, little bits and pieces there, okay. So this is now starting to work. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to take all this stuff that's going to be coming down here. You notice this is still filling up. This is nice and eventually this is all going to fill up and will be sorted and as you can see things are just jumping into my inventory as I walk past it's quite fantastic now there's stuff we want and there's stuff we don't want okay and the stuff we don't want is flint we don't want coal and we don't want gunpowder because we make those not coal we want coal um, bone meal, that's it, we don't want bone meal because we make loads of those in other places so what we're going to do first off is throw that stuff away I just want to put a barrier there because we don't want this pipe connecting up to this pipe so we'll put a pipe down there and then we shall get a trash can where's my trash can? Do I not have a trash can here? Oh, there I do. There's my trash can. I was using it. So we'll take the trash can and we'll put that down here. Oh, there it is. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll just pop that down on here and we shall configure this. Oops, there we go, make it naughty. So the same way as ever, we configure it like that and we're going to tell it to whitelist, so only put in gunpowder, bone meal, and flint. Okay, so now, you see all the flint has disappeared and we're left with things that we're, we, we want and we're going to want to start sorting that stuff now. So that's where we, we move on going down here. And these are all the items we can produce. Okay, so what we want to do is start shipping these things out and uh, moving up to the top. Uh, so we can get rid of those three items. Doink, 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 and they just disappear. As you can see, this is starting to fill up. We've got loads of diamond, that's nice. Uh, Yu Gi Oh! I like Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Oh! is fun. Alright, so, right. What we're going to do is we're going to have a pipe here, and we're going to pipe it out to our first chest. Our first chest? I think this is about our fifth chest, but uh, you know what I mean. Alright, so that chest will go here. 